Skillet is, is one of my nicknames that goes back a, a long ways. I played basketball in high school, probably the worst high school basketball player of all time. And my JV coach, um, I was so bad at catching the ball, and one day he just yelled at me and goes, Bert, I'm gonna call you Skillet because you have hands like frying pans. I've quickly moved away from the sports arena and moved to something a little less physical. I'm Burke Phillips. I'm a senior strategist here at Siegel & Gale on the brand communication team. The power of brand really lies in meaning. What does your company stand for? What do people associate you with? Brand communication is all about using the power of language, the power of storytelling, to influence what that meaning is, to influence what people's perceptions of your company are. So if you think of a brand like Ben & Jerry's, you have a very distinctive impression of who they are. And a lot of that comes from brand voice. They have a voice that's very uh, sort of funky. Uh, it's irreverent and funny, but it's kind. You see it on social media. You see it on their product packaging. They're one of the most memorable brands. And, and I think this idea of how memorable you are is a key part of you know, what you're trying to do when you build brand equity. You want to stand for something that sticks with people. And Ben & Jerry's is just a good example of a company who does that really well with voice. When we start to think about voice, you want to create consistency in your impressions. Say, for instance, in your social media marketing, it feels vibrant, fresh, and irrelevant. But if I have an interaction with customer service that feels corporate and transactional, the contrast between that and the different voice I've seen elsewhere just makes me confused about who you are as a company. So what we'll often work on with clients is creating a set of voice attributes. And these are kind of like uh, guidelines or guardrails where your voice feels like a powerful brand that's expressing who you are, but something that you can consistently replicate in all the important places. All right, thanks y'all. We'll have to splice some of this together.